Hello my lovely attractive subscribers, this is Chris in the Craft here bringing you a tutorial on how to install Risugami's mod, it's a uh, mod loader. <clears throat> now you need mod loader to install many other mods because those mods require that you have mod loader installed in order to install their mods such as um, Mo Creatures, Timber Mod, and Millinaire. <clears throat> those are just a couple to name. Um, now what you're going to do is you're going to go to this website here and it'll be down in the link and there'll be a link uh, uh, for it down in the description below so you can just go down to it <clears throat> and um, you're gonna go right down 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 you're going to look for mod loader it's right here <clears throat> now what you're going to want to do is um, you can these are two download links right here um, <clears throat> to support the mod maker what you're going to want to do is click this link here and this helps him uh, to get to collect revenue <clears throat> now I have an uh, ad blocker on so usually ads pop up all over here and what you do is you wait for the seconds to go by and you skip this ad and the download starts automatically now you get uh, something called modloader.zip <clears throat> you just save the file and uh, I'll clear this out remove from list and then I'll go to open containing folder and um, <clears throat> you've got this file here now if you don't have the program to properly handle this file, you will want to watch my tutorial on how to install WinRAR. And that uh, annotation will come up right now. And that video is also in the link. Uh, uh, that video is also linked in the description below. So that way you can do that. So uh, you can pause this video, watch the other video. <clears throat> and uh, once you're done installing WinRAR, you come back right here. You can right click and extract to mod loader. What you're going to do is you can what you're going to get is this file right here. You go ahead and open it up and you have all these different class files. <clears throat> I'm just going to go ahead and close everything here. After this, you're going to want to put these class files into your um, into your minecraft.jar file. Now, how do you do that? <clears throat> what you're going to want to do is you're going to go to your uh, Minecraft profile manager. If you don't have this, I have a um, I have a tutorial on how to install this and how to use it. <clears throat> um, you don't have to use this file uh, per se, uh, but it is um, advisable so that way you can keep a default Minecraft. I mean, if you know what you're doing, then go ahead and do what you're going to do. But um, these are for people that don't really are, aren't really sure. So what I'm going to do is after you've watched the uh, tutorial here, the annotation will come up now. Um, you can pause the video, go there, watch the tutorial. It's also going to be uh, linked in the description below. What you're going to want to do is you want to go to profiles and install the mod in any one of your profiles that you want this mod to be installed, which is mod loader. It's going to be on every single one of your profiles anyways. So the profile we're working on right now is Chris and the Craft. We're going to go in there. We're going to click in the dot Minecraft folder. We're going to go to the bin. And we're going to open up the jar file. <clears throat> now, if you have WinRAR, you can just go ahead and double click this and it's going to open up this uh, window here. What you're going to want to do is you're going to take these files and you're just going to drag it right into this window right here. Right around this area, you just drag it right there. Then you're going to click OK. <clears throat> OK, so now that you've done that, you're going to want to run your Minecraft. So we'll just go to our Minecraft Profile Manager and I'm going to run Chris in the Craft. I'm sorry, I forgot something. What you're going to want to do um, after you've been, after you've uh, put all the files in here, you're going to want to delete this meta inf file. Go ahead and delete it. <clears throat> now you're going to want to run your Minecraft. So what you'll do is go to your profile manager if you have this installed, and I'm going to click on Chris in the Craft because that's where I put it, and launch the profile. <clears throat> And then you're just going to want to log in. And so your in. Minecraft is on now and Mod Loader has added different folders to your mo .minecraft folder. So let's check that out. So we're going to go to our profiles. We're going to go to Chris and the Craft and a .minecraft folder. Now you should see a bunch of these folders right here um, that are different. And uh, that's how you know Mod Loader has installed correctly. And this ends this tutorial. Please like, favorite, and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave it down in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching. This was Chris in the Craft. I'll see you later.